Bonjour, I'm Valentin Ria, the team leader of Team Terras, and it's a team that built an autonomous quadcopter based on Arduino, uh, completely from scratch. And um, so, what, what part do you enjoy the most? The part that I enjoyed the most was uh, programming microcontrollers, interfacing sensors, uh, trying to figure out the algorithms for PID control, uh, for flight control, and finally I guess uh, turning problems into solutions is something I really like. It's turning problems into non-problems. Hi, my name is Ida. I'm a team member of Team Acres. What was the favorite part of your project? So my favorite part is uh, working with my teammates, especially the uh, Wi-Fi and camera part. At first, we, we successfully have a live video from the Raspberry Pi, but the delay is around two seconds. After that, we found a solution for that using M Player, and we can have a live video with a low latency right now. It is so awesome right now. This is our setup with a Raspberry Pi, um, taking a picture of the screen that is just um, it shows seconds and then it sends the signal through this router all the way to uh, this laptop and this screen shows uh, what the camera is uh, videotaping and when I have a, a picture of the two screens you can see the delay which is almost uh, zero it's, it's it should be around about a, a few hundreds of millisecond a uh, few hundreds of a second maybe, maybe half seconds yeah, within yeah half maybe half seconds. less than half a second yeah. delay Can which uh, which is really great so the camera footage is not that great uh, the quality is not really nice but that's, that's what good. we get and we're gonna try to get better quality uh, by getting maybe, maybe better frame or a better cage but right now it's very very uh, fast, fast so yeah, fast no, low latency almost no latency very low latency yeah. Hello everyone, I'm Wang Yuzhi. Uh, Wang Yuzhi. I'm a member of Team Icarus. What was the most exciting moment of this uh, project? Uh, the most exciting moment is the moment that I finished the mapping program. After writing uh, 400 lines and removed enormous errors that keeps the program from running, I suddenly found out the program runs perfectly and uh, the, re uh, the results are all correct. Uh, that, that makes me uh, the most exciting moment. Hello everybody, I am Ming Kun Zhu. I am the team member of Team One Eclus. I'm responsible for the motor and distance sensor part. What did you get out of this project? Uh, I've learned some practical hardware skills such as soldering and I also enhanced my ability of programming such as writing C languages Arduino. What's most importantly I enjoy the sense of achievement when I have progress on in this project. The sensor is right here, and this is the data. You can see we have the filter. The field is the wrong data, based the data in the field. Take your shirt off now. <laughs> you can see this is 50 centimeters. Now we are hovering. There is a 10 second delay. Hello, my name is Vicente Basaldua. I'm part of Team Icarus. My part is Wi-Fi and video streaming. Uh, what was the hardest part of this project for you? The hardest part of the project was, was the delays in the video streaming. Every time we would try to get a stream, it would, there would always be a delay. But we managed to overcome that after a few weeks of tinkering with the media players and also other using other software. Hello everyone, my name is Jinke Li. Hello, my name is Li Jinke. 
What was your favorite moment of this project? Okay, keep holding it that way. Hold it. Huh? Make it straight. Make it a bit straight. That was the time uh, when we finally assembled everything into the quadcopter and achieved the PID control uh, for the quadcopter because there were so many uh, tough moments before uh, this achievement and but finally we uh, agree on the, on the direction and move forward to that finally achievement of this uh, PID control.